Here are your Manchester United morning headlines on Sunday, February 26. United squad versus Newcastle includes Marcus Rashford Marcus Rashford has travelled with the Manchester United squad to London for the League Cup final against Newcastle on Sunday. Rashford sustained an apparent ankle injury in the second half of United's Europa League playoff win over Barcelona on Thursday night and was substituted in the 88th minute. The England international is United's top goalscorer this season with 24 goals, Rashford's best tally in his eight seasons with United. United medical staff assessed Rashford yesterday and today and the 25-year-old has been named in manager Eric Ten Hag's travelling squad. When asked about Rashford's potential availability on Friday, Ten Hag said, I don't know. Players are now coming in. United boarded a train at Stockport Station on Saturday afternoon ahead of the 4.30 p.m. kickoff at Wembley tomorrow. United are permitted to name up to 12 substitutes in Europa League matches but will be restricted to the usual nine substitutes in domestic competition against Newcastle. Click here to ready the full story. Antony sends message to fans ahead of Carabao Cup final Antony has told Manchester United fans to keep believing in the team ahead of the Carabao Cup final this weekend. Eric Ten Hag has helped to create a noticeable bond of togetherness, particularly at Old Trafford, between players and supporters this season and various members of the dressing room have discussed the importance of that feeling. United have made impressive progress with Ten Hag in charge and they now have an opportunity to end the club's worst trophy drought for over 40 years in the Carabao Cup final against Newcastle on Sunday afternoon. The Reds will be supported by 32,000 fans inside Wembley during the match and Antony, speaking ahead of the game, has lauded the club's fans and the impact they regularly have. When I came here, I said that Manchester United is a huge club and we're going to put this club back where it belongs, fighting for and winning trophies, Antony told United's in-house media. Click here to read the full story.